Hi, I'm Peter Coey and I'm a doctor of traditional Chinese medicine and an acupuncturist. I'm currently the Qigong teacher at Radiant Near Live and I also run an acupuncture clinic at Radiant Near Live. I've decided that I'm going to run a acupressure course. People have been asking me about traditional Chinese medicine. So I'm going to run a course and it's a certified course so that by the end of the course you'll be able to conduct a acupressure treatment for a patient. I've also discussed in depth about the traditional Chinese medicine aspect. We go into depth about the yin yang theory and how that works and how that affects our body and also quite a big piece on the five elements or the five phases and the five elements not only in the how the, they affects the body but also ourselves and our own personalities around the five elements as well and how that affects dysfunction in the body and how the Chinese a long time ago worked it out how they could treat the body through acupressure or acupuncture to actually bring about health, to, to balance all these energies inside the body and using either yin-yang, five-phase or other theories because there's quite a few different traditional Chinese medicine theories to bring about health in the body. The difference between acupuncture and acupressure is that acupuncture uses needles on the points and acupressure uses your fingers to stimulate the acupuncture points. You still use the same points on the body but you're just using pressure so it's a lot less invasive. Acupressure is a very, very common practice for people, and, and I use acupressure myself, especially for people who don't like to have needles. So it's quite important to know that you can use the same modality or treatment strategy without having to use needles. This course is a certified course, so by the end of the course, you will be able to conduct an acupressure treatment itself from right from the start, from the diagnosis, all the way through to the post-treatment strategies. Also during the course we're going to do a Qigong practice every day to bring energy, not only get the energy moving into our own body but also to increase our own sensitivity in our hands so when we're doing the act pressure we can feel what's happening as the energy inside the bodies. This course I think is for professional people that already do body work and for people who'd like to learn more about traditional Chinese medicine and from beginners into advanced people there's information that you'll get that will be really useful during this course especially about how to treat people and it gives you another tool for your toolbox to help you understand and how to bring about change and good health to anybody's physical body. So come and do the course, I think you'll get a lot from it especially if you're interested in, in traditional Chinese medicine and you've always wanted to understand a little bit more about how the energy moves in the body and how you can change it not only affecting yourself and how it can affect other people. It's a very valuable course and there's lots of information and lots of technical details about traditional Chinese medicine. Come along, I'll see you on the course. Bye bye.